Air is an essential component of our planet's atmosphere, but it's much more fascinating than we might think. It's not just an empty space, but a complex mixture of gases that plays a vital role in sustaining life on Earth. While we often think of air as primarily oxygen, it's actually a mixture of gases. The Earth's atmosphere is primarily composed of nitrogen, about 78%, and oxygen, about 21%, with trace amounts of other gases like argon, carbon dioxide, and neon. Air has mass and weight, even though it's invisible. A cubic meter of air at sea level and room temperature weighs approximately 1.225 kilograms, 2.7 pounds. The density of air decreases as you go higher in the Earth's atmosphere. This is why the air is thinner at higher altitudes, making it difficult to breathe without supplemental oxygen in places like Mount Everest. Air can hold moisture in the form of water vapor. The amount of water vapor air can hold depends on its temperature. Warm air can hold more moisture than cold air, which is why you often see condensation on cold surfaces. Air pressure is the force exerted by the weight of the air above us. It decreases as you ascend in altitude. At sea level, standard atmospheric pressure is about 101.3 kilopascals or 14.7 pounds per square inch. The lower air pressure at high altitudes can affect our bodies. At extreme altitudes, the reduced pressure can lead to altitude sickness, which can cause symptoms like headache, dizziness, and shortness of breath. The speed of sound in air is around 343 meters per second, 1235 kilometers per hour, or 767 miles per hour, at room temperature. This is why you hear a sonic boom when an object travels faster than the speed of sound. Air can be compressed or expanded. Compressing air can lead to an increase in its pressure and temperature, while expanding air can lead to a decrease in both pressure and temperature. Air is affected by Earth's rotation. The Coriolis effect, caused by the Earth's rotation, influences the movement of air masses. It contributes to the rotation of storms in the northern and southern hemispheres and impacts weather patterns. Air can be polluted. Air quality can vary greatly due to pollutants like particulate matter, nitrogen oxides, and volatile organic compounds. Poor air quality can have adverse effects on human health and the environment. Air is essential for fire. Fire requires three elements, fuel, heat, and oxygen. In this case, air provides the vital oxygen needed for combustion. Without oxygen, fires cannot burn. Air is a poor conductor of heat, which is why it's used as an insulator in buildings. Double glazed windows and insulation materials help maintain indoor temperatures by trapping a layer of still air. Air is often taken for granted, but these facts show that it's a remarkable and essential part of our everyday lives. Understanding the properties of air can help us appreciate its importance in various aspects of science and our daily activities.